Okay, wow, we are uh, only uh, two videos away from uh, Sumo Battle. Um, so now the next thing to do is, hey, let's make our robot stay inside a, a Black Merchant ring. And you can probably imagine that is really trivial. Um, what do we have to do? We just simply make it so that it turns the opposite direction. I mean, last time you did it, it was following a line. So if it hit the, the line, it steered away from it. What I want to do now is um, if it hits the outer edge, I want to steer back toward the middle of the, the rink. Um, so that's nothing more than switching this, for example, this turn left to a turn right. And this uh, turn right to a turn left. And my guess is we want it to turn pretty far. I mean, we, we don't want it to just hug the edge. We want to be able to move toward the middle again because we're going to find another robot with our feelers. What's ultimately going to happen is these, these two sensors here, which are looking for the black line, are going to be looking for the edge of the arena. And if the robot bumps into anything else into the arena with its feelers, it's going to steer toward it and then line itself up and try to push it out. Okay. So my guess is that this number here, this 200, not big enough. Let's try to make it, um, oh, I don't know, 400. We want it to turn pretty far. And this is the sort of thing where you say, well, wait a second. So if it hits the outer edge of a box so you've got a box it hits the edge do you want it to just turn do you want it to back up or what kind of routine do you want it to do that's going to be up to you uh, to try to decide what's the best strategy for your sumo fighting bot for the moment um, all i want to do is just avoid the edge i'm going to leave all the the fancy footwork up to you guys in fact actually even though i just said that i'm going to make it even bigger i'm going to make that 500 and 500 okay and uh, now what I'm gonna do I'm gonna plug it in and I'm gonna hold a little bit off the ground here because it's gonna start going I'm gonna upload it And of course, you can see it responding, as you'd expect it to do. And this is very important. I don't want to write over the last program I did. So I'm going to save as, let's go ahead and I'm going to pull that out. I'm going to save as, let's call that in uh, the rink. And save. Okay. So I'll attach a small video to see how it does, and uh, we'll go from there. I'll see you soon.